All right, so I got a couple of photos we can play with. Uh, this is the Atari logo. We're going to just uh, kind of stick this down in the corner as as kind of like, uh, I don't know, like we're pretending that it's a sponsor of some kind. Okay, and then we'll add a photo. And we'll do the like and subscribe one too because, you know, we want you to like and subscribe this. By the way, if you do like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. That helps me with the algorithm, gets uh, the video exposed to more folks. Um, and if you like it, I mean, maybe you want to tell people about it. So go ahead and share. So this is subscribe, like, and share. We'll, uh, we'll get this sized up. And we'll put that up in the other side. And right like that. There we go. See you. There we go. Hey everybody, welcome back to the Rattleblaze Den. We're with Bleed again. Um, I believe. Yes, we just finished a gig. That's the last thing that we did, I think. Tonight, we got some other stuff to do. We got a lot of new things going on. A lot of things have changed. Um, it's another massive update that's happened. Uh, we'll go through as, as much as we can as we go. Just going to continue playing the song and we'll deal with it as we come along. So we'll do our usual, let's repair. Okay. Just doing our usual repair. Most of our folks don't aren't very good at it, so you know. Hey, that's good. Alright. Now, one of the things I know that's new is the Shady O'Grady awards so it's going to be important for us to get an album out in order to do that let's look at our band info here we only have a popularity of one in fort collins and we last found out last time that we need a two in order to hire a manager um which we really do need and these guys are not getting along uh i wonder what that's all about everybody's pretty much uh broken to 82 percent health i think that's from the car accident we had so let's go rest for a couple of days Pick this up on Monday. Okay. Let's look at the band info again. Yeah, they're still not liking each other a whole lot. But, you know, we'll see what happens with that. We'll, we'll do what we have to do. All right. Let's go into, uh, let's write a song. Okay, so in your uh, you write a song screen, um, you know you can uh, play with stuff. Uh, let's see what we got here. When we look at our guys, one of the important things is going to be uh, production. Uh, Rattle Bunny's got mm, none. Josh has yeah four. Victor has six, and Joan has two. So we're not you know. Not really kicking butt on the production end of things here, so we're going to need to work on that too. Um, so playing, production have become important. Um, I'll show you what happens here. We can develop ideas. And you see how we can combine things. But we only have six points remaining, and these are your points. So we can do these two, and this will come up with a three, I believe, because now you, the only numbers, the only uh, values you have now are three, one, three, six, uh, 15, 25, and I think 35 is the top. Um, don't hold me to that. That's, that's what I think. So this is Josh's riff. We're going to try and improve that. So we'll combine that. And now we have a three riff for Josh. Um, down here we have a, uh, yeah. Down here we can do a couple others. We can combine some lyrics, apparently. Destitution lyrics. Get that a little bit better. Um, but let's see what we can do with these melodies. Let's see what a 20, 20 difficulty and 20 difficulty, identical, what happens to them? Keeps the 20, makes it a 3. That's pretty cool. All right. So then uh, what else we got going on here? All right. Well, I think that's about it. We're going to keep this 6 because you know we like the 6s. Let's see if we can put it in the other. We have a 10. No, no, that's we're in develop ideas. Construct song, please. We have a ten. 
We have a six. We have a six. We have any lyrics that fit? Ooh, destitution lyrics. Ooh. But you know what? We got. Oh, let's do that. Let's take these two destitutions, combine them, go back to construct a song, drop that in there. All right. So we got a 25 and 13. It's not the best song we ever wrote, but it's a song. It's about destitution. So uh, the dice, I believe, is going to give us a random song title. Let's see what that does. Nobody extends the shelf. Okay. All right. Um, okay. We're going to hang on to it, and we're going to make that a medium. Um, and let's do it. Let's write that song. So, nobody extends the shelf. We can repair again, so let's go through that hell. Okay. All right, so let's go into practice. Now, in the practice area, we've got a couple of things that have changed too. Um, the sorting has improved. Now you can go sort them all according to highest to lowest. And if you click it again, it'll change to it's green now. It'll change to yellow. That tells you that's going from lowest to highest. Um, and that works on, on all of them, I believe. Um, so, yeah. Um, sort by written. That's what it usually is. So, Okay, so nobody extends the shelf is the one we've got. These are still doing well. So let's, um, let's go to our song list because there's some changes there, too. Um, like I said, tags. We don't really have a lot of very popular tunes right now. But if we go to Nobody Extends the Shelf, okay, we can change the tags. It shows us what we use to make the song. And as long as we don't record it on a CD, we can um, salvage those ideas so they'll go back into our, our, our two-week bin there. And we can combine them with other stuff to improve the song, rewrite the song, that kind of stuff. But once you salvage the ideas, the song, I think, disappears. Um, and you have to redo it again. But uh, right now we're looking at Nobody Extends the Shelf, which we got randomly. And if we view lyrics, it will actually come up with lyrics on the fly. You know, so I'm standing on the shelf staring at the clock. Despite their lies, we have built this war machine. Despite their lies, we have we drown in destitution. Okay. Um, okay. Um, yeah. Lyrics by Josh Alonzo. That's that's really kind of cool. So we'll do that. Let's do it again. Nope, that's the the lyrics. Just stick with it. All right, so let's give it a song file. Uh, we got to go find our stuff again. So we're looking for my mentalness. Uh, there we go. Music for video, Rising Star Safe. We do everything with Ethan Mixel. So, what was the last one we did? Let's uh, let's cancel this. We might have to do it again. Let's uh, let's go out of this. By, by date written. This is the last one we did, and that's Angel of Mercy. Okay. So this one, got a song file, and his was Angel of Mercy. Was the last one, really? That was the last one? Um, okay, this is confusing me a little bit. Uh, how many songs do we have? Let's do it that way. Cancel. We have nine songs, so eight songs have been used. Let's do this. We'll go to the ninth song, and that's what we will use. That's the way I'm going to do it. Three, six, nine. This is Driven to Madness is the one that we've got. We have our lyrics, we have, our, and then we can tag it. All right, so right now we've got destitution and basic musicianship. So, um, <clears throat> hmm. Uh, you know, I'm not gonna use tags right now. Um, these two are gonna be the most important to me, I think. Uh, US, Canada, and Europe, because that's gonna tell us later on down the road. I can tag the ones that are hits there, and we can keep track of them that way. So, but this one's random, so I'm gonna, Click on that, and it will give us a tag of random, as you can see it here, and we have that in there. So, let's go back. Let's do our practice. Let's practice that for two days and see what happens. 
Oh, Kurt Cobain died on this date. All right. Let's uh, practice for two days to get to Friday. We do have a gig coming up on Saturday. All right, let's see what we got going on in the city tonight. We go to the theater, but we want to get our reputation up. So let's go to the Thirsty Detail. That's where we're going to go. All right, I'm going to take off. I'm going to check on our mowing, like we always do. Looks like that cemetery needs to be mowed. Get that landscaping done. 350 bucks, guys, every time you do this. 350 bucks. And when you get started, 350 bucks is a lot. Heck, for some of us, that could be a guitar. I know if I had 350 bucks to burn right now, I'd be down at the guitar shop. Personal thing, you know. Just mainly because the computer parts I want to buy are a little more than 350 bucks. Okay, where are we going now? Oh yeah, we're going to the Thirsty Deal. But first, we're going to stop in these places and see if we can get some more gigs going. Because we have got to get our popularity up. We really do. So let's go in Grizz Power. There she is. Hey Grizz, how you doing? Uh, how about you get me a gig? Oh, we got an opening spot here. They still don't qualify for that, huh? Oh, they got four bands already too. So, But we're really not in their category. Um... We're going to set it as a reminder to watch. Wish with the cloud and in the learning. Okay, 78 bucks. Yeah, we'll take that next week. All right, thank you. Off we go. The one with the star around it is the one we're playing at tonight. So we're going to go... Or the one that we're watching tonight. So let's go into Bruce's bar. I'm not sure where our next gig is. Probably Bruce's bar. Oh, pretty good. Oh, no. No, no, no. So we'll get another opening spot. Um, they're not as good. We get paid 10 whole dollars. All right. So that's another one. I'd like to see your band up there. Let's, um, let's go to band info. And... Discog and merch. We got no t-shirts. That's right. We haven't got t-shirts yet. In this one, we're going to get a manager. We definitely are. It's just going to take some time, I think. Or not a lot of time. We'll find out. We're gonna. Uh, okay. I was looking for something to show me my upcoming gigs other than this, but this is at Coleman's Bar. Okay. All right. So, thank you for the gig. Almost smacked the wall again. The thirsty detail. Wish with cloud. All right. So we get some good numbers. Lost some cash. Head back to the house. $2,500 straight up is what we've got. That's pretty good. Let's practice again. All right. So we got a gig at Coleman's. All right, but let's um, let's look at this song list. Happy Hilton doesn't tell us this because we wrote it before the update, so that won't tell us that. Uh, can't do lyrics because we wrote it before the update. But we can do tags. And it's basic musicianship and destitution. So, eh. I don't know. We'll figure something out about all this stuff. I think you can add tags this way, too. Oh, yep. Yep, you can. So, let's see. Let's use this for fast. So we'll get all these to be fast. I don't know why we'd need to do that, because red is good, but... Let's just try them out. See if it helps us in any way. And let's see. Let's go with... Um, uh, huh. Smiley. For the medium ones. So this one needs a smiley too. Okay. 
I don't know why I did it that way, but all right. <clears throat> all right, so we got a gig tonight. Let's go to our gig. What we're gonna do though, is there's a new thing that we can do, which is really kind of cool. We have 2,500 bucks, so we're really not gonna be hitting this too hard and heavy, but there's one thing I wanna show you in here. If you go in here and you go to repair, now it gives you the opportunity to refurbish everything. Um, obviously, we don't have that kind of cash, so we're not going to be doing that right now. But once we get a manager, we're going to try and finagle our way into a great opportunity. But look at some of these over here. 88 bucks for that guitar. Oh, yeah, we'll buy that one. And this one is 148 bucks for a Jackson. Yeah, let's get that, too, because we can make some money on those, I think. All right. Anything Josh could buy that's... No. Victor, you got anything in here that's good? Ooh, 16 on Grandpa's Djembe. We got Grandpa's Djembe going on. Okay. How you doing on everything? Symbols? Yeah, you're doing okay. You have one. Yeah. Is there a $200 symbol set? Uh, da, 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 da. No. Not looking like it. All right. Joan, anything you can get? All right, $29 sure, PG-48. Let's uh, let's get you that one. See if we can fix that one. All right, <clears throat> so we got that. And yeah, that's what you can do with that. Um, you can name stuff like we've been doing, but uh, we could look for a fifth band member. Maybe another guitarist would be good. But we got a gig tonight, so we're not going to do that because that will mess up all of our play skills right away. So... Let's go over to the park and see if we can get some mowing in, get some extra cash. Oh, it's already mowed, so let's uh, let's busk. Let's do our thing. Let's get Grandpa's girl get her out. And I like the way they rearrange the uh, the actors in this. You know, they're closer together. It's it feels a little bit more natural. All right, so we got some extra experience, made a couple of bucks, and we will go do our gig. All right. Coleman's Bar and Grill. Hi, Coleman. How you doing? Yeah, I know. You got any battle coming up we can get in? No? Not looking like it. All righty. Off we go. Play our gig. Well, you know what? Uh, we're gonna get rid of Happy Hilton and we're gonna go with Sleepless. Sleepless on Lansdowne. That ought to do it. And because that will give us, that'll bring that back up to 100. So let's go ahead and start this gig. Not generating a lot of excitement in this one. We are still a fledgling band. Might break 25. Yeah, there we got it. All right. Oh, a talent scout from a record label is at the gig. Um, you know, I'm not really sure how much veracity that actually handles. I've, I've never uh, played through a game of this and just allowed record labels to come in search of us or managers to come search in search of us. That's, that might be something I'll do in another playthrough. But um, So, yeah, we got a lot of good stuff. We've got 20 Inspiration. That helps. Um, in the set list analysis, they've added the energy that, ha that was resulted from playing the song. Um, and the overall interest. So you can take a look and see what the interest level change was. Um, which helps us in a couple of things. Like you can tell, at least with this, with this crowd, that Honey Teach Me and Hot and Hanover were the two big songs. We got a change of, of what, 4% uh, here and 6% uh, here, the difference there. Well, maybe it's uh, Summer of Joy is more. 
So Hot and Hunover, Honey, Teach Me, and Summer of Joy were the big ones in that crowd. So, you know, it, it, it helps with things like that. Joan's gone up a level. Let's give her some production skills so we can start getting some stuff combined and get some better tunes going because that's the way that works now. So let's go home. Uh, we can we can go ahead and repair again. Let's see what we can do with those, uh, those new items there. Um, all right, got that fixed. All right. Way to go, Victor. Not that one, though. All right, so... We're gonna let him handle that stuff. We'll let the uh, the other mumble fingers go through and just destroy stuff, because you know that's what they're good at. So, all right, let's go to practice, and we're gonna do our trick where we recall the set all. It's a preset that I made, and we click on this one, save it to all, and that will select all the songs. Just easier for me to make sure I can reset the clocks on these tunes at the end of the week, and we'll practice them all one night. Okay. Now, I don't think we got any... Did we... I didn't notice that. Oh, we are at a popularity of two now. So, let's go get that manager guy. Yeah. Let's go do that. It's Sunday. Let's go knock on his door. Where is he at? He's over here. Here, manager, manager, manager. Come on, buddy. Uh-huh. Here we go. Barney Chapman, I think, was the guy who would do us at two. So, let's, let's see Barney. Hi Barney, um, 400 bucks a month. We'll we'll take that. Let's uh, let's hire Barney. Yay! We got a manager. Cool. First thing we want you to do, Barney, is just for a little while book some local gigs. We don't care where. 250 miles of Fort Collins is good. Let's just uh, let's see where we go from there. Okay. Now we're out and about, so we'll go ahead and go back to the park and do some bucking. few more bucks that helps all right and let's see what do we got going on tonight nothing so let's head back to the house Go back in here we can repair again let's see if Victor can repair anything all right almost almost got that fixed up okay Alright. Oh! He got something. Which gave him an up on his uh, his thing, so we'll get some more production value out of him. And I'll show you what that does to us here. Nothing for Rattle Bunny. And nothing for Joan. Alright, so let's go into write a song. Um... I'm going to develop some ideas here. Okay. I like the way they rock. I'll tell you, you can uh, do some stuff. We have nine points because of the additions that we've made. Uh, okay. Let's go ahead and combine these ideas. Makes them a three. We're going to combine that, and we're going to put this down here. And then we have four here. Boy, can we do... How many of these can we do? Okay, we can do all of Jones. That gives us three. What will that give us? Oh, a three and a one. And if we combine those again... Oh. At six points, it would cost. We don't have six points. All right. All right, so let's go back in here with these. And let's do... What happens when you combine love and hometown pride? Let's find out. Stays hometown pride. Okay, I think it's the one you click on first. All right, so that works. 
And so let's try that again. Click on happiness first and then destitution and let's give it a shot. Happiness, all right. That works. All right, and we got one left, so there's nothing that we can do otherwise. So let's go to construct a song, see if we've got anything that's good. We got a six and nothing. Let's go six, six, and six. That's an 18. And, well, we can do Hometown Pride. That's one of the ones we combined. It gives us a 21 with a 24. Hmm. All right, we're going to try and get to 12 songs, just to have a basic 12 set. So, Hometown Pride. Uh, running with the boys. And we'll go ahead and write that. All right. Now we hit practice. We've got two songs to practice. We've done all the others, so we can just concentrate on those two. So let's start this practice. Go for two days. All right. I got another level up, so we're going to put that all into production. All right, and let's start practice for another two days. Hopefully we can get nobody. There we go. Metallica sued Napster. So we get triple. We have Grizzly Power. That's where we're going. And we can try the new song. All right, but running with the boys. This is a, this is a high speeder, so we give them that one. And it's hometown pride, but eh, it's really we'll just go with that for right now. And let's give it the the next song on the song list. Let's add that in there. Let's go to song file. That should be fight or flight. And let's see here. Let's generate some lyrics. Why not? Let's do it. Oh, server's writing our lyrics. Oh, here we go. Running with the boys. Interesting. Okay. Well, there we go. All right. So we've got that song running with the boys. Eventually that we'll play at a gig, but uh, we'll get there. Okay, so we do have a manager. Manager hasn't called us or anything yet. So we have a gig tonight. Let's, um, let's go out to the Grizzly Power. Well, actually, let's go get some work done first. Some busking, and then we're also going to keep, well, actually, we're going to landscape first. All right. Three times experiment. That's another thing I really like that they're doing. They're putting this in the corner. I don't want to run off the map. So you can see how much experience that you have. So anything that you do today, you get triple experience. Hopefully we should have got triple experience on the mowing. I don't know if we did get experience for that. So let's go see if we can find some more gigs. Because our manager hasn't gotten to us about anything. So we don't have to worry about conflicts. We're not really traveling that far yet. Back at Thirsty's. Hmm. No, they're still not interested in us. Oh, the ginormous hooks again, though. Well, let's put that in there to watch. And let's go play our gig. No, it's not our gig here. Let's uh, let's get out of here. You don't want us to play? That's fine. We don't have to play. Check Bruce's bar. Hey, Bruce. Oh, it's great to see you. All right, back in with Bruce. Oh wait, no, oh, we got a gig up there tomorrow. Are you That's here right. For the show? No, we're not. We're leaving. All right. Let's go down over here to the one bar that has to be on the other side of town, which is oddly, actually analog to uh, Fort Collins because, um, you yeah, know, it's a college town, so there's there's bars in Welcome. all corners of the town. So, hi, Coleman. Oh, look, we got some more options here. Uh, wish with Cloud. Dis 
The Distinct Lip. And not for 29 bucks. Wiggle with the Face. We played with them before. Eh, 29 bucks. What do you got next month? Peace in the Cup. Eh, still 29 bucks. Songs to play nine, though. Um, yeah, let's do that next month. Okay. Then we'll get a nine gig, and we can check, check that out. All right. So, off we go back to play our show. Here we come, Grizz. Can start the party once we get there. It's fun to try and skid your van right into the parking spot, I think, anyway. Hey, I know you guys are gonna do great. Let's hope, Grizz. Let's really hope, okay? Because, you know, we really want to do great. We need some t-shirts at your merch table. I... You should get them printed at a local print shop. Yeah. Your merch table is in dire need of CDs. Get well, some recorded. But... Hey, you should get a banner to hang behind you during gigs. Oh, we you should do that. A local print shop. Okay, let's 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 do some things for our band here. Let's get some self promotion out of the way. Local print shop, where are you? Down on the other side of the block. So let's go to the local print shop, and we'll see what art pirates have to give us all. Our matey. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, okay, t-shirts are five dollars a piece. Yikes. Um, all right, so let's let's buy t-shirts. Let's get a hundred t-shirts. That's gonna take away five hundred bucks. Mm, okay. And that's two hundred dollars for a gig banner. Still keeps us over two thousand, so we're okay. So yeah, let's um, hmm. Let's find a font we like that's better than that. Yeah, that looks kind of good. Um, let's see. Oh, we got alignment now. Okay. That's cool. So left brings it over there. <laughs> well, it moves it once. <laughs> All right. That's cool. Okay. Uh, letter space, line space, size, bleed color amount. Okay, no, that's fine. Let's get that... Um, let's get a good blood color. All right. And let's change the background to a white. Yeah, will that work? Yeah, bleed. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah. Let's get in here with some uh, some stuff. I'm pretty sure there's like uh, interesting stuff in here. Basic shapes, no. Beasts, borders, bugs, chains. Splatters, there we go. Yeah, there we go, blood splatters. Let's get this one in there. And actually, we're going to copy the color from that to give to that. And we're going to move it. Gonna put it up towards the top. And we're going to shrink it. There you go. And let's add another splatter. This is a little bit bigger one. It looks kind of like an arterial little splatter. So we'll paste that into red too. But let's rotate this one. Okay, I don't know a lot about blood splatter other than what I've seen on TV, but uh, let's try and make this look like somebody bled all over it. That's what we're going to do here. Add another one. This one. This one we're going to paste. And we're going to make this a little bigger. Yeah, we'll do it that way. Let's add another one. Uh, let's go with this one. Make that red. Rotate it the other way. And we're going to put that down towards the bottom. And way over here. Let's rotate it a little bit. 
trying to keep as many of the splotches as we can visible. And that should be pretty good. Let's see. I know there's a way to add um, miscellaneous photos. Oh, import photo. What can we do to import a photo? Um, all right, I'm gonna import some photos and I'll be right back. All right, so I got a couple of photos we can play with. Uh, this is the Atari logo. We're gonna just uh, kind of stick this down in the corner as, as kind of like, a, I don't know, like we're pretending that it's a sponsor of some kind. Okay, and then we'll add a photo. And we'll do the like and subscribe one too, because you know, we want you to like and subscribe this. It, by the way, if you do like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. That helps me with the algorithm, gets uh, the video exposed to more folks. Um, and if you like it, I mean, maybe you want to tell people about it, so go ahead and share. So this is subscribe, like, and share. We'll, uh, we'll get this sized up. And we'll put that up in the other side. And right like that. There we go. So it looks like the transparency um, that's on the some of the, the files, um, if the transparency said it, it carries through with the game too, which is which is really cool. We Oh, we could reverse it too. No, we don't want to do that. What about the Atari one? Yeah, let's do that one backwards. Iretta. Additive blending? What's that do? Oh, no. I have no idea what that does. Okay. All right, so there's our, there's our banner. Let's buy this sucker. That's what we're going to use. We'll buy it, and uh, yeah, we want to buy that banner. And we'll call it the Bleeding Tour. Banner 001. Who knows? There could be thousands. All right. So we have that. We have some t-shirts. We have a banner. Let's go back and play our git. All right, so Grizz, what do you got to complain about now? We so, record some CDs. CDs. About at your merch table. Okay. Any other advice? Love the eyeshadow, by the way. That's it's it, that's wonderful. All right, let's see what everybody wants to hear. You got any idea? Climate change. Yeah, we don't do that. So we don't do much of that. Uh, climate change. Eh, looks like climate change is going to get to be pretty big, if it's not already. Sex and climate change and sex. Okay. All right, so let's play our gig. Uh, we need six songs, and we're gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna well, let's just let's let's clear the set list, and we're gonna do "Honey, Teach Me," "Hot in Hanover," "Nobody Extends the Shelf." That's our new one of our new songs. Uh, "Damaged," "Free Rain," and "Summer of Joy." All right, that's what we're gonna do. Okay, here we go. For 78 bucks, 250 people capacity, let's do it. Well, Honey Teach Me is not a very popular tune. Nobody Extends the Shelf, not a very popular tune. But we'll check the numbers when we're done. All right, well, 25%. Sold out show. Lots of people came to see us, which is cool. We like that. Uh, let's see here. 24 fans, right. Almost 10% of the people out there liked us or were fans of ours. I uh, got some happiness and some other stuff, some reputation points. Very cool. Now in our analysis, let's see, this gave us 4%. This gave us 6 Okay. This gave us 3 And we extend the shelf is not popular. Uh, it gave us 4, 3, 5. All right. All righty. So let's head back to the house. We're still on the 3X, apparently. So let's repair, because it gives us 3X, right? So, 24. I don't think it's giving us 3X right now. All right, 
right, we got some stuff repaired. Oh, Josh got a repair skill. Good job, Josh. Will rattle money? Uh, probably not. No. All right. And I don't know. I guess it did look like three times, so all right. Let's hit the practice. I'm gonna run with the boys. Bruce's bar. Oh, we got a call. Brian Mares from the Anxious Ornaments. They got a gig coming up tonight that we might be interested in playing with them. Um, oh, coming up that not tonight. Okay, let's see here. Grizzly Power. It's the twenty-first. Hey, it's my birthday. My actual birthday. Uh, with the ginormous hooks. Yeah, we like them. Yeah, we'll do it. Yeah, 78 bucks. Let's, we're on it. Let's do it. That's next Friday. We can deal with that. All right. So, let's practice. We don't have... Oh, we, now we can't practice. What am I doing? Um, all right. We have some other guitars. Oh, we can, we can put this... <laughs> let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it. Why not? Let's put the Atari logo up there, too. What the heck? Why not? It's kind of fun. Let's see if we can repair some. Alright. I'm not going to wreck it any more than that. Uh, let's go do our gig thing. Get some work done first. Cemetery's all set. It does not need to be mowed till probably next week. So let's hop out here, play some tunes. Now we're going to play this gig, and then I'm going to try to get us into a situation where we're going to make some bucks and get some big time experience. Uh, we're going to try to get out on a tour uh, with a big name band, so we're playing theaters and arenas if we can. Um, it's going to be difficult to do, but we're going to get out there and do it. Let's get into this. Hey Bruce, how you doing? Okay, we will. All right. You should record some CDs to sell at your gig. Uh, we're not there yet. Nope, we're not there yet at all. There's only 60 people. Let's see what people want to hear. Climate change again. Climate nature, climate change. Climate change. What about you two here in the corner? Nature and basic... Oh, God, I'm sorry. Basic musicianship we got covered. All right. Let's play our game. Six. Okay, what do we know? We know Honey Teach Me is not popular. Uh, so we're going to hit buy me. Oh no, honey, teach me. Not popular. Buy me. Put that here. Uh, Nobody Extends the Shelf was not a happening tune, so we'll do the Happy Hilton in here. And let's give that a shot. There's our nice banner. Yeah. Irata in the corner. Nice. Jamming right along. I'm going to speed this up a bit to get through some of these gigs a little bit faster. Just because we don't really have a whole lot of stage presence in. They're boring as hell at the moment. So we're going to try and fix that eventually. So 27% this time. A bunch of people come to see us. Reputation went up at the bar. Nothing major, though. Just our, our pay was 10 bucks. All right. 25 fans. We had a lot of fans in there. All right. And let's see. Hot in Hanover was good. Buy Me was only a four. Happy Hilton was only a four. 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 I, think, I see a theme going on here. 